consider this video as a call to action to uh, Dr. Craig Wright to contact, contact his, his legal counsel in the Copa v. Wright case and ask the court for permission to liquidate his BTC according to the $6 million injunction order that's been put upon him once and for all. I did a video yesterday, we've talked a little bit about this already before in the past, that the court in the Copa v. Wright case has issued a $6 million injunction permitting Dr. Wright from liquidating any of his assets. All right? If, if, and you know, consider this hopium if you want, I talked about it short yesterday, but it may be hopium if it is, that have ever existed. But consider if it, if it, if he does have BTC to liquidate, let's say, uh, well, let's not make any assumptions. If there's BTC to liquidate, he's required, the court's gonna require him to, that's the cable car making a bunch of noise down there. Um, the court's gonna require him to ask permission first to liquidate it. And before he gets the opportunity, he has to go to his counsels and they're gonna have to file some sort of a motion. But if, for those who, you know, would like to see closure on this issue once and for all, this is the one opportunity I'm seeing by the 12th, because the hearing's gonna be the 12th for him to ask the court for that permission. Because it would, it would, in a hopium sense, if he did have access to the, let's say the Genesis block keys, or the, uh, what is it, block nine keys, what are these keys, and he wanted to sell some of those Bitcoin, if he, if he had those, such a thing, now would be the opportunity to legally do it. And the reason being is because the court's frozen him from doing anything. He's stuck. He cannot He cannot sell, move, transfer BTC at all. He really has no, no option of doing it, or any cash at all, until he goes back to the court. So it's a, it'll be an interesting time, I think, over the next couple of weeks to see what he does. Uh, because, you know, if I were him, and if I had access to those BTC, I would, I would motion the court, and I would say, hi, your honor, I see that you put a $6 million sanction against me or injunction against me from liquidating my, any of my assets. May I please sell the, uh, you know, some of the 27 Bitcoin that were sent over to the Genesis wallet address into USD so I can pay this, this debt that I owe to the other side, uh, my learned friends over there at COPA and BTC Core. It would be a, a huge opportunity. I would, I would definitely motion the court and say something along those lines. And so, hey, you know, this should be considered entertainment purposes only, but I do think that this is one of those uh, unique opportunities. So I, hopefully this message finds Dr. Wright in one way, shape, or form before the 12th. Uh, I don't think he needs to hear this, to be honest. He's probably got this, whatever he's going to do, he's going to do. He's got it thought about in his head and his strategies. He's getting, I'm sure he's getting sound legal advice. You know, but I just want to give him also just a word of encouragement, you know, because uh, no matter what happens, you know, there's going to be a freaking beautiful end uh, 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 end to this to this puzzle of this entire entire piece of the puzzle, and it may not look good. It may not look good at all right now. It may be ugly. It may be destructive. It may look like oh my gosh, the world's going to end. But if uh, if he does see this, I want to let him know that there's a freaking much brighter light on the other end of the tunnel. And I'm not just saying that metaphorically, but there's a, a heck of a good positive outcome to come out of this no matter what you see on the surface right now. But so consider this as a call to action. And if there is such a, such a, uh, if there is such access, if there is such private keys that exist in some place or trustee, now would be the time to contact that trustee and start to set the foundation. Because if he was asking the court for the legal right to do it, the court would have to respond and then issue an order. And it would make it as a matter of law Craig Wright is required to access these keys and sell these to give them to my learned friends over here on the other side. And, well, in a funny way, wouldn't that be poetic justice? Don't they call it poetic justice? Or injustice? You know? Back down here at the Fairmont, San Francisco, as the fog is rolling in over the city, how do you like that? This is Gavin Mail. If you like videos like this, hit the like button. Hit subscribe, share the video, get the word out there for entertainment purposes only. Don't forget the Salesforce channel. I'm going to do a video on this as well. I got some of the cool stuff to come on that. And I have some whole new uh, ideas I'm going to put out on this channel. So be sure to hit the notification bells, leave a comment, and share comments on Twitter if you see this is there as well. And I will see you guys at the top.